بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم رب زدني علما the next thing we'll try to understand the 80.11 n standard now again this is uh, one of the next standard which was introduced now this standard is going to operate in both it supports both 2.4 gigahertz or 5 gigahertz ranges so which means you may find the devices operating on 2.4 or 5 gigahertz uh, frequency bands again now one of the major enhancement with this 80.11 is the throughput so if you try to see here the 80.11 n standard is going to provide you up to 600 mbps of throughput depending upon the number of antennas we use like if you are if, if any access point a device it supports let's say four antennas so you can you can still have to uh, 600 mbps of throughput so if that standard is running uh, two antennas so it can have a throughput of around 300 mbps so again it depends on that so that is one of the major enhancement now now one thing we need to understand here is so how it's going to provide such a huge throughput so it uses something called multiple input and multiple uh, output mechanism now now this mechanism is a method of increasing the capacity of that particular radio link uh, by using something called multiple transmission and multiple receiving antennas so this is just like multiple uh, antennas will be transmitting and multiple antennas will be receiving so so that way the throughput is actually increased so it it's it something like sending and receiving more than one data signal we are sending simultaneously now apart from that it also provides some enhancements like frame aggregation now now in the case of frame aggregation what happens is it is going to increase the throughput by sending two or more frames in a single transmission so just like in a single transmission multiple frames are actually sent also there are some kind of security enhancements you will find in this so like additional uh, security parameters has been added or some more enhanced uh, security is improved so if you just try to see the difference between the previous uh, models like the set Edno dot N, which is again introduced in 2009, operates in 2.4 gigahertz or 5 gigahertz range, and the throughput it can go up to 600 mbps. And again, the distance limitation is also a little bit different. So again, these are like the the distance, uh, the throughput again it varies. So distance again it varies on multiple factors it supports, and again the throughput also varies depending upon the number of devices. and what type of access point or what type of device we use in general 